All right. Tyler asks, hey, Bo, I watched a previous episode financing a Planet Fitness franchise using SBA 7A financing. I am currently contemplating starting a fitness concept. I am evaluating uh, my my buying power first. What intrigued me with your past show was that we can potentially get high leverage financing. I believe my old 401k would qualify for a rollover uh, for my down payment. Essentially, I'm not getting much of a return with the 401k, and I'd like to roll that into a potentially good cash flowing business. It makes a lot of sense to me. Please walk me through your thought process on this and what I might want to start looking into. My 401k has about 350k in it, and I also have 150k liquid. I am retiring from my career in law enforcement in about three years and have the time and bandwidth to get this going now. Looking forward to hearing your thoughts on a future episode. All the best. All right. Um, So fitness franchise concept, uh, currently working in law enforcement, W2. Um, You have an old 401k. So basically, um, if the 401k is is from a previous employer, um, it's probable that you can utilize the Rob's rollover plan. So what I would do is I could put you in, in, in contact with one of our resources, our partners that handle these Rob uh, rollover plans, and they can they can uh, give you the, uh, the sniff test to make sure that this is eligible to be rolled over. But essentially, if it's if it's eligible to be rolled over, you can take that $350,000 and invest, invest it into this franchise startup. Obviously, it sounds like you're still going through the different franchise concepts. I know there's a, a handful of them that you're probably looking at and, and we'll look at, but yes, I think you, that would be a great way to start. So basically, if you can get in for 10 or 15% of total project costs, you know, you can be looking at purchasing a two to $3 million franchise concept with total build out. So if you're doing a, a big box type of gym, it sounds like you'll have enough capital depending if you do something like that or at any time fitness, which might be a little bit smaller. So depending on that, that would be a great idea. I think uh, it sounds like you can do the rollover um, and, and really it comes down to like, you're going to keep your current empl- employment. I think that's great. Um, cause you're going to have the income coming in. Um, sounds like your credit's probably fine. So basically, um, the, the next steps would be to really kind of vet out and find the right franchise concept, make sure it's an SBA on the SBA directory that it's SBA financing eligible. Um, and then we put you in contact with our, our partners that do the Rob's rollover, make sure you're uh, 401k can be converted or excuse me rolled over and then that would be the next checkbox and then it's really just doing the due diligence on the different franchise concepts and figuring out what makes the most sense for you but yeah this is sounds total totally doable um and i think it's good that you're still working your w2 job because it, i don't know if you have any other entrepreneurial or, or business experience but that's the one good thing about a franchise is that sometimes they overlook like, Hey, I've never worked in the fitness industry, but you know, I, I have, I'm buying a, a concept a, a blueprint. So that makes it easier. That's why franchises are sometimes easier to finance than a startup. Like if you're going to st- start your own gym concept, that's going to be a little bit more challenging. You're not going to get the same leverage you w- would by um, buying into a franchise that's already got a thousand or 600 units or 500 units or 400 units. Right? So, I would say um, to, it's total prob- t- totally probable we can make it happen. I would be happy to put you in contact so you can find out about your um, Rob's rollover plan. And you can just simply book a call below and we can discuss uh, this in detail a little bit more. But thanks for the uh, question and comment. Appreciate it. Hi, if you'd like to book a call with me and discuss SBA financing, whether it's a 7A or 504, or you just don't know where to start, maybe it's a startup business, you're buying an existing business, you're buying a franchise, you're building a new office building, you wanna expand your existing business, we have multiple solutions. I can walk you through the 7A and the 504 and the SBA loan process. And if you have any other questions on any other types of financing, I'm happy to book a call with you. The link's below, look forward to seeing you soon. Hey guys, Bo Exine here. If you enjoyed what you saw, please subscribe to this channel. We talk all things financing. I've been in the lending industry for over 20 years and I'm happy to answer your questions and provide great content.